All right, I'm sitting here again with a follow-up to the Expensify um, Droid app, which I found out to be pretty cool. I'll show you why in a minute. Um, so let's bring up Expensify real quick. And you'll see it's uh, very similar to how it was before. Um, you can upload a receipt. There's several different ways to do this. Um, you do get uh, the, um, the picture like this. Um, the way to deal with it, there's no button on the screen itself, but um, it's the button that's up here, uh, which is a, a way to take a picture. It's not a way that I usually do it, but it's a way that you turn on the camera. You can also take a picture that way. So if you take that picture, boom, it takes it and um, uploads it right to Expensify. So you can see that it's uploading as we speak, and uh, I guess it's in, um, it's in the process. But uh, that uh, makes it very, very easy to do if you if you know that inside and out. But I'm really like an Expensify for a couple of other reasons too. Um, one of which came out very, very recently, and I'm going to show you that real quick. Um, looking at my laptop screen now, um, they came out with something um, on the Google Apps Marketplace, which uh, just has to be seen to be believed. You can come over here and you look down. If you add to your Google Maps or your Google Apps different things, you can see here I've got expenses listed. Um, this is right: calendar, documents, sites, and expenses. And for uh, for my company, I have expenses. You can go straight to that, and it whips up, and it shows you um, uh, the regular Expensify screen. It's all the way hooked up with your Google Apps account. Um, so this allows you to, for your entire company, to do expense reports very easily and it all looks like it's uh, seamless within Google Apps. Um, all of the login information and everything is shared. Um, but even past that, there's one other thing which is just uh, too cool to skip, which I've got to show you. They've really done a great job integrating this with a ton of things in addition to Droid and everything else. Um, but this is how you do a new expense report. Now, if I wanted to, oops, actually zooming in, wanted to add another expense to this report, you can see I can uh, put everything up here. I can categorize it. Now, if I pull this down, you see all these things: um, vehicles, advertising, contract labor, education, um, a whole bunch of different things. Now, these are not default. What these are doing is these are pulling straight off QuickBooks Online. So what I've done is hook, hooked up this. Expensify account to my QuickBooks Online. It pulled in all of my line item categories and I was able to take out the ones which really made no sense on an expense report and only leave the ones that did. And um, there's a feature in here where once somebody submits uh, an expense report correctly and it's categorized correctly, it automatically can sync back up with your QuickBooks Online. Um, that is the shit, as they say. Anyway, um, come back for more and hope you enjoyed this. Bye.